What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have another awesome video for you guys. Uh, get right into it. As you guys know, hold on one second. But today we're going to be redoing the windows, man. Uh, I used to have my whole windshield tinted, but you guys never saw that. Um, I wasn't, well, it was in the beginning, my first video. If you want to go see how dark it was, uh, you can see I tinted the windshield. I did 20% on it, but it was like stupid dark, so uh, they ticketed me for that. But I do have a limo on the side, but as you guys can tell, um, I don't know if you guys can see, it's uh, pretty see through now. So, and then you can see right here, right? Uh, my car locks automatically, so when they were painting it, uh, these guys were trying to get inside the car and they scratched the tin all up. And this was the main thing right here, guys. All of this. It's all glue, guys. So, what we're going to do is, we're going to just strip off all this old tint, and then I'm probably going to do a double limo in the back, back here, honestly. And then, uh, for the dot matrix, I'm going to show you guys a little trick. I know everyone has this problem when tinting their car with the dot matrix. I'm gonna show you guys how to get rid of that. So if you guys are interested in that, stay tuned. Honestly, you could probably see that. Yeah, you can see the dash right there. So uh, we're gonna start stripping off the old tint and then I'll get back at you guys. What's going on guys? We're back in the car. Um, right now we have to switch locations real quick because I'll go have to go somewhere. So. Uh, yeah, he does my tent in, uh, for my car. He does like most of our family stuff. And then check it out. I don't know if you guys can see. There's literally no tent on this back window. Like it's crazy. I've like I've never driven a car with no tent. Like it, it's crazy. The first thing I do to my cars when I get them is uh, literally tent them first. So um, I just want to take this time right now that I'm driving over there. Um, I just want to take this time, guys, to thank you guys so much. Honestly, like 600 subscribers. Uh, you guys are awesome. So like just keep up the support. Um, if you could drop a nice comment down below. Keep your boy uh, keep your boy motivated. Keep on pushing me, you know. Uh, it means a lot when you guys do that. Um, I just hope I can keep on entertaining you guys. Um, I just got this new job, man, so there's a lot more stuff coming. I'm telling you right now, the build isn't gonna stop. It's only gonna get more and more better. So when we hit a thousand, I'm gonna do like a smoky burnout for y'all, and then we're gonna put some fat tires on the back of this thing. Like we already have 295s, but that's not big enough. We gotta get into the threes, baby. We gotta get into the threes. 1,000 subs, I'm doing a nasty burnout for y'all, and I never do burnouts in my car, honestly. Like I never do, like, I don't know. I, maybe it's just because I'm a pussy or something, but. 1,000 subs, we're coming real soon. Um, four seductions on the way, bags, some other shit. Like I'm not gonna, I don't wanna put it out there too much, but this is gonna be a clean asset to 95, I promise you, and it's gonna be fast. It's not just gonna be show and no go, it's gonna be show and go. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'll see you guys when we get there, and uh, we're gonna get this thing all tinted up. I'm pretty sure if I have any, uh, if I have enough tint left over, I'm gonna do double on the back, back window, and then I'm just doing limo on these again, the side windows, and then I'm gonna do an eyebrow on the windshield. So uh, we'll see you guys then, and uh, I'll show you. Later!
back. Uh, I'm really sorry for the I'm really sorry for the delayed videos. Uh, that video that you're watching, well, the video you're watching right now is supposed to be out on a Tuesday. That's when I release videos. But uh, the tent job didn't get finished, and I had, actually had to get someone else to do it because my uncle got busy and stuff. So I finally got the tent on right here. Um, I'll show you outside the car, but I'm on the way to go wash my car right now because I've been like neglecting this car. Um, I finally got a new job, guys. So um, it's gonna be awesome. Now I have more money for mods, more money to do things that I want to do with this car, you know. And things are gonna be freaking awesome. So. Big things are on the way. I want to give you guys a little update if you guys are wondering from the PI Swap video. Um, I know I got some subscribers from that video, so if you are a new subscriber, welcome. Thank you guys so much for coming to this channel. Um, I'm usually on my ball. I'm usually on the ball with uploading videos. It's just I haven't I haven't been able to upload, you know. And I do work four days a week now, and uh, well, basically like five days a week. And I'm about 24 hours on call, so I don't really have time to be making videos anymore. But I will on my off days, you guys. So um, don't worry about that. Just worry about the content coming out, and I'll worry about getting them out to you guys. And um, going back to what I said about um, neglecting my car, um, I've been taking it to work and everything, you know. And there's a bunch of like uh, rocks and like mud and stuff over there. And I don't really want to uh, be driving my car over there anymore, you guys. I, it like it just messes up my car, and I'm worried about the paint getting messed up over there. Um, I need to invest in it daily. So after I get done with this PI swap, I think I'm gonna have things on hold for a little bit. I know I told you guys that force force induction is coming, and it is coming. But I need a daily if I'm gonna do force induction. You know, if the car is gonna be down for a little while. I want to do the force induction by myself and maybe with the help of my dad or somebody else. So if the car's going to be down a while, I need a daily to get to work. I need a daily to get around, go buy parts, stuff like that. So a daily would just be so great. So before force induction, I need to get a daily. So that's on the that's on the list for sure. So if you guys have any um, any suggestions for a daily, um, just throw them in the comments down below and I will consider them. But I kind of I already have a, a thing in mind for a daily that I want. Um, what else was I gonna say? Oh yeah, and I'm going back to the PI swap. The PI swap is getting done now. Um, I just didn't, I didn't, I didn't finish the PI swap because things came up with the heads. I needed to get new roller rocker arms because um, they're kind of worn down, and I'm not gonna throw some heads in here that I bought off of some guy, you know, and um, start having problems with this car when I've never had a problem uh, engine-wise, you know. So. Um, I'm, I'm just replacing everything as needed. Uh, if it needs new valves, it needs new valves. I'm gonna put new valves in there. But as we're looking right now, all it needs is rocker arms. And um, uh, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna throw them in like that with the PI cams. You guys are probably wondering, Chris, if you're doing the PI swap, you're just changing the heads. Why aren't you upgrading the cams? Well, uh, like stage three, stage four cams don't really work well if you're gonna go forced induction. And I plan to be going forced induction here pretty soon. I really want to uh, do this forced induction setup. So I'm not gonna throw the cams in there. And then um, when I throw forced induction in, I'm gonna have to remove the cams. You know, that just doesn't make no sense. So I'm just gonna do the PI cams and the forced induction route that I'm going. Uh, it's fine with the PI cams later on. Um, if I start making more money and stuff, I'll invest, I'll, I'll invest in some turbo cams or some supercharger cams, uh, whichever route I'm going. Um, but that's that for now. Uh, I should get pretty good gains out of these PI cams and the PI heads. Um, maybe start giving you guys some more race videos for sure. Um, what else was that? I, was, I, I did a little poll on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow my Instagram, it's uh, 4.6 Chris. Um, I do a lot of polls on there. I talk to you guys a lot on there. I know I have some subscribers on there as well. So if you're over there, I appreciate you. Um, I did I did a little poll if you guys want to see a turbo kit or a supercharger kit or nitrous. And a bunch of you guys are saying the force induction, obviously. And uh, that's the route I'm going, man. I'm going to do force induction on this car. I'm going to build it. And... Um, just make a solid good boost for now until um, until I want to go higher and boost then I'll just pull the motor out I don't know if I want to blow the motor up or if I just want to pull it out change the rods and pistons and then uh, just go forge and then just max out the boost you know maybe go a bigger turbo if the 
the, the power isn't enough, you know, because uh, I know these blocks are good for like 700 horsepower, and I don't really want something over like 650. I mean, like 600 would be awesome. Like I'm smiling already, like just thinking about it. So I want like a maybe like a 500, 550 wheel uh, street car. That'd be freaking amazing. So uh, I know these blocks can handle it. It's just the internals are bad. So uh, I'm gonna give the two valve a good name. Uh, so right now guys, I'm pulling up to the car wash right now um, I'm gonna take you guys off of here and I'll show you guys the tint. It came out great um, I'll show you guys right now Alright you guys, it's finally clean, red calipers, I didn't make a video on that, sorry about that, uh, like I said man, 5%, this is double right here, you can't see anything inside, this is double, but this is still a single layer, I'm gonna do double, as you can see my eyes just in the back seat, but uh, yeah that's because, oh and this, I didn't end up doing this, but what I was talking about, guys, is uh, for the dot matrix, what they do is they just cut along this line right here, all the way across, and then just lay a strip of vinyl, and that gets rid of that dot matrix, man, but she's all tinted again. I'm really happy about it, man. I love the way that dark tint looks. There it is, man. I hope you guys like it. Um, like I said, limo right here on this one. Uh, let me see if I can get this. You can see how this one right here, you can see how it's a lot darker than the back one. This is double limo and this is single limo. So it's like the back and the front are like the same. You know what I mean? So uh, limo right here, the triangles are double limo. And you're probably asking why. Well, the triangles I did myself, uh, they're pretty easy. Um, I wanted to go ahead and do the back window, but I didn't want to waste any more any more of my money. So, uh, man, my dashboard's dirty. Um, so yeah, limo, double limo on the back, and then soon to be double limo on the back. But right now it's just a single layer limo. Uh, help me out, guys. I'm thinking about painting this hood, man. I know y'all like the carbon fiber look, but I'm going back and forth, man. I kind of want the paint to match look. I want the clean look again. But then again, um, I don't know. Uh, maybe you guys can let me know. Um, I also, just a teaser, I have a wing coming in. I know you guys have been telling me to put a wing on it. It doesn't really bother me that much, but a wing does look good. So I went ahead and got another wing, and I'll have a video on that shortly. So, uh, yeah, guys, um, as always, if you guys did like the video, please drop a thumbs up. and means so much to me. It helps out my videos so much. If you're a new viewer today and you guys like these videos, Please hit that subscribe button. It means so much to me. And uh, like I said, 1,000 subscribers. We're going to go ahead and send it. And we're going to get brand new meat for the back. And uh, I can't wait, man. This, this journey is going to be awesome. I'm telling you guys right now. So without further ado, guys, we'll see you guys later. I'm going to go ahead and get up on out of here. I'm sweating like a pig. So um, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. I wish that I can rewind.